In this protocol, we are showing the fabrication process of cross-point devices incorporating amorphous vanadium oxide, which actually dissolves in water. And further, this protocol helps us to improve our understanding of nanostructural changes during the biasing operations. This protocol allows a visual analysis of nanostructural changes related to device biasing and can be extended to any metal insulator metal device structure that's compatible with high vacuum. This protocol can be easily extended to do in-situ temperature or temperature and biasing together analysis to reveal the atomic level changes happening within the device. To pattern the bottom of the electrode of the crosspoint device with photoresist, first spin coat the photoresist onto the wafer at 3000 revolutions per minute before soft baking at 95 degrees Celsius for 60 seconds. Next, use a 405 nanometer laser to expose the device to 25 millijoules per square centimeter and bake at 120 degrees Celsius for 120 seconds. Use a 400 nanometer laser to flood expose the device with 21 milliwatts per square centimeter and use developer to develop the pattern. Rinse the device with deionized water and use a physical vapor deposition system to deposit 10 nanometers of titanium and 100 nanometers of platinum onto the substrate pattern on layer 1. To lift off the deposited metals, place